and you can expect more music and cultural events this season. That is because summertime is festival time. Yes, but apparently there's a scam for everything. So unfortunately, if you're looking forward to some fun, scammers are coming up with ways to take advantage. Yes. Carolyn, what do we need to know? So you don't want to be asking where's the money? Festival season is here, right? You've got music festivals, art fairs, pub crawls, carnivals, you name it. But now the Better Business Bureau is warning to not be fooled by the fakes. So here's what they're saying they're getting complaints about. You see a really cool festival being advertised on social media. You follow the link, it takes you to a website. The website looks great, the photos look great. You buy into it and then it never happens you realize it doesn't even exist. So here are four questions you need to ask before you buy. Have I done my research? Because always do that research. You need to search online to make sure you're buying from the real festival website and not an imposter. Criminals, uh, Better Business Bureau says criminals will um, take a name that sounds similar to a real festival to fool you. The second question, can I connect to the organizer. I need their contact information. So you have to check the festival website for that contact information and then make sure it works. So you need to actually make the phone call, send the email. The third question to ask, can I pay with my credit card? You need the protection of a credit card in order to dispute those charges. The fourth question, is this website that I'm on going to buy these tickets from, is it secure? The easiest way to tell is that HTTPS, that it should be on the beginning of the web address and it has a lock symbol on the address bar. And also just remember, if it seems too good to be true, it probably is. You're probably not gonna get a four pack of tickets with free food and free alcohol all day for $20 a piece. Really? And don't go to Firefest. <laughs> Sorry, y'all yeah. remember yes. that? I always look for that lock. Oh my goodness. On the website. That is good advice, good Carolyn. Tips. Thank yeah. you so much.